and I will always be with you as you walk with me and glorify me. That's saying, your Lord, Jesus. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah, Lord. Lord. Thank you, Lord God, for that Jesus. love. Thank you, Lord God, that you Thank love you, us so much, yes. oh you, Lord. Lord. Yes. Even though we are unlovable, you love us so yes. much, oh Lord. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Lord, that you are, oh Thank Lord, you, Lord God, awesome, Jesus awesome Christ, God. the most wonderful mm-hmm. Lord. Thank you, Lord God. We bring love. Hallelujah, Lord God. That even though, Lord God, the world is so trembling, Lord, you are here, Lord God, with us, oh mm. Lord God, walking with us, oh Lord God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Comfort, oh God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Mm. Praise you, Lord Jesus. We love you, Lord. <coughs> Glory. Thank you. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Praise Thank God. Jesus. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. God bless us all. Thank you. Thank you, Lord. In Zephaniah in Zephan, uh, 317, it says, The Lord your God is with you. The mighty warrior who saves, he will take great delight in you. In his love, he will no longer rebuke you, but will rejoice over you with singing. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. I just thought about it. That's not my, that's not my lesson for today. Awesome. But this just came to my thought. Thank you, Jesus, for your help. Well, um, I just want to praise God for this day. just want to praise God for the opportunity to share with you um, the most the most precious gift that he gave to us, and that is his love. Thank you, Jesus. You know, I'm in love every day. I I, I don't know about you, but I'm in love every day. Hallelujah! (laughs) Thank you, Jesus. But you know what? um, When Christ died for us, that's the, that's the, the outward manifestation of God, of his love for us. He gave his only begotten son, that's in John 3, 16. He gave his only begotten son for us. Amen. Imagine you giving Sean for the world. I know you wouldn't like that. (laughs) But God is so good Mm -hmm. that he wanted us not to perish. And he wanted us to to live in his love and to be partakers of his love. And not just love. The love that God has for us is an unconditional love. That no one can fathom, no other creation could, can give us but Him. So it's about time, I believe, that we all be partakers of that love and share that love amongst Amen. us. Amen? Amen? Amen. You might say unconditional love is really hard, you know. But what about His grace? What about His yes. mercy? Amen. You know, God is able and so. He enables us to give that love. Maybe it's not that easy, and he don't, he don't promise us an easy one. He don't promise us an easy one. But by his grace and by his mercy and by his faithfulness, we can do all things yes, through Christ who gives us strength. Amen? Amen. Amen. So um, John 3.16 gives us the greatest affection of, of love from, from our God to us. And Ephesians 2, 4, 5 gives us the, the love, that, the, the unfailing love that God has for us. And in Romans 8, 37, 39, this is so great. That nobody, no other creation can separate us from the Amen. love of God. That's Amen. Right. Amen? Amen. Thank so you, Lord. there is a tie. There is.
is an um, unbreakable tie that God has for us that cannot be broken, that cannot separate us from him. See how God is really good and how, how great is his love for us. Amen. He wanted us to be, be feeling that love all the time, to be, to be acting that love all the time. And you know, we are, we are so blessed. And every day I know that we feel that love from him because we are chosen. Uh -huh. Amen. We are chosen, and that alone says that we are dearly loved by Him. Yes. So there are times I know that sometimes we, we, we find it so hard to love our brothers and sisters. There are times as human, and I don't make that as an excuse, but there are times that we want to cut the love because we don't wanna <laughs> we don't wanna be connected to, to our brother, to our sister, right? Mm -hmm. But you know, seven is seven times seven God Hallelujah. forgave, forgives <laughs> us. And the, you Thank know, God. I believe that even we get into the sin, he already has forgiven us. Mm -hmm. That's the kind of love that he has for us. Amen. Amen. Yes. You know, and God is, you know, he is he is he is a good father. He is the provider. He is a loving father. Man. He forgives and he gives everything <coughs> that we don't even need. Sometimes it's overflowing. Thank you, Lord. It's overflowing mm. and we don't see it. No, his blessings are overflowing. It's already there. He, he told us it's, it's been finished. It's done. It's for you to rub the blessings. Mm. We have our names in those blessings. It's 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 up yes. it's up to us if we grab that we had a name on that not being selfish but I want everything that has my name on it. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Amen. So it's already there. It's already there. As for a child, it's already there. You have a child with your name on it. Amen. That's how good he is. You have a man with your name on it. I, I grab mine. So, yes, <laughs> thank you, Jesus. So we you, we don't want your. We don't want your blessings to be stored in the warehouse yes. of heaven. And we want God. everything. We want everything that God, and he, he, he loves us, period. He loves us. He loves us so dearly. He loves us. And the love, and the kind of love we can pass on to our children. We can pass on to our friend. And it don't matter if they're believers or not. You know, when we walk the talk, that's all that matters. But see, when we have been chosen by God, when we have been called by God, that love has been marked. We have a trademark of God. Mm -hmm. The trademark of God is love. You know, the cross is about love. Christ is about love. Yes. God is love. Yes. Amen. 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 So how can we ever, how can we ever share that love? Really. The Bible says, if we if we help our brothers and sisters and, and don't love, it's Amen. useless. Everything that we do without love is useless. Yes. So I do believe if we give our if we give ourselves the opportunity, you know, to have God in our hearts, that He would reside. We don't have, we, we don't want God to be to be just visitors of our houses. Amen. We don't want God to be a visitor of this place. We want God to reside in this place. Amen. We yes. want God to reside yes. in our homes. Yes. We want God to reside in our hearts. Amen. Amen. And only love can make God reside in us. Yes. It's only love that, love is, love is um, uh, the, the ATM to God. Love is, love is uh, something that I may say faith is the, the currency of heaven, but love is the uh, gate pass to heaven. It's all about love. God is all about love. It's the overflowing love that we don't even that we don't even feel sometimes when we get discouraged, when we get disappointed. We forget about the love of God. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But God is so good that whenever we want to go back to Him. 
his arms are wide open, Amen. open to yes, embrace us again. Mm -hmm. So I just, I just want to thank God for what He has done so many times in my life, because I couldn't do it myself. But with the love of God, and mind you, He loves us that He controls us. You know, He won't put us to shame, mm -hmm. especially mothers. You know, um, I was blessed with four. And mind you, it's not easy because they differ. They differ, and I was just sharing my testimony to to uh, to Helen this uh, this afternoon. Time after time, time after time, you know, seems like the testings and the trials won't stop. That's right. When you're done with one, here comes another one. I tell you. When, when Honey, when my first had, a, had her 18th birthday, I surprised her. She didn't even know that I was giving her a party in one of my events. So it was in an event center. I called the dancers to dance for her on her 18th birthday. Mind you, next day, she, she surprised me with a statement that she's pregnant. <laughs> So what do I do just to embrace her and say, it's going to be all right. Amen. It's going to be all right. You know, Amen. In the, in the, you know, in the midst of brokenness, he gave you a child. He trusted you. He loves you. And you know, God, you know, God entrusted you. Though, that is life. That's a gift of life. Not every, not everyone is, 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 is uh, blessed with life, you know. Amen. And you know, not not ev not every not every woman is is blessed with a child. That's right. Amen. So whenever, whatever, <laughs> so ever, I just praise God for that. I said, "Thank you, Lord." And he and she said to me, "Why are you thanking God for, Mom?" I, I just thought you, you'd be discouraged and you would slap me. I said, "This is not the right time, you know, because the baby will feel my slap on you. So let it pass, okay?" <laughs> so. Uh, we are enjoying Carlia now, uh, her first. But you know what? When I was already complacent with the thing, here comes another one. Gail, Gail came home bleeding, and you know this is the first time that I, I want to share it to you. My my second daughter, actually she's my third child, but she was my 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 younger daughter. She went home three o'clock in the morning bleeding. She was raped. And at an instant, she had a baby. She wanted to get rid of the baby, but I, I you know, I, I kept, I, I kept on feeding her with love. Yes, amen. There's no other way that we can show, you know, our sorrow yes. and our, you know, and, you, and our grief and our mourning, but through love. That's right. So she wanted to get rid of the baby. I said, baby, no, no, no. She can hear you. Please don't. Let's pray for the baby. And now here comes Alex. Praise God. I am not excited for the third one. <laughs> you know, uh, a blessing. You know, it's 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 blessing. I yes. don't see it as as problems because you know we don't even know the man. Mm -hmm. But eventually he came to the church and found us. Mm -hmm. So I just, you know, I just I just praise God for uh, for his love, had it not been for his love, yes, had it not been for his love, how mm -hmm. can we ever know? It's yeah. not easy. And tear after tear after tear, God is with me. Amen. Amen. I have been all alone raising my four, but God is with me all the time. Thank you. Amen. God is with me all the time, and that and that love, you can see in the eyes of your children. You know, and God will prove it to you. God will show you what comes after loving. You know, the unconditional love isn't that easy. It isn't that hard to give. You know, but but we we need to have God in our hearts, and we need to be serious about it. Mm -hmm. You know, see, when we do business, we're serious with the business. When we do business with God, all the more that we need to do. That's right. Yes. Because yes. it's the only business that 
that don't have bankruptcy is secured, mm -hmm. you know, and forever it will leave, you know, it, it won't, it will, it will prosper. We know, we all know that, that there's no business like God's business. Amen. 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 It's satisfaction guaranteed. That's right. Amen. Amen. So, um, in Corinthians 13, uh, 4, 6, God describes what is really the meaning of love. Love is patient, love is kind, love is not rude. And seems like if we go into the word, it's really hard to pass it on. But you know, um, if we just if we just remember the cross, yes. which is the which is the, the manifestation of God's love for us. We will always be reminded that we don't have, we don't have, um, we don't have to have any doubt that we can give each other love. Even, even if these people do us wrong, you know, um, this, is the, this, is the, this is the time that, that God would test you of your love. In the midst of, in the midst of hardships and in the midst of torment and in the midst of, I believe in the in the midst of uh, of sorrow, in the midst of um, deepest sadness. You know that we sometimes feel that really it's hard for us to love. You know, but we we ought to know we we ought to remember the love that God has for us. So every time we see the cross, we rejoice. You know, we don't, we don't mourn anymore. Amen. We rejoice because we have been free. Thank you, we Lord. Have been, you yes. know, we have been loved. Yes. And we have been redeemed. Amen. Because of his love. So, you know, um, let us just share the love of God every day. Love the unlovable. <laughs> And I know it's it's not hard to do it. Amen. Um, just reach out to brothers and sisters, you know, and just take a step of faith to love even the unlovable. Because when you take a step of faith, God is delighted, and the love won't be gone. It will stay there forever and ever and ever till He comes back. Amen. Amen. I hope you get blessed today. Amen. So let us yeah, let us all stand for for the offering. <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord, for this day. What are you? Oh, big man. Amen. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Blessings to all the saints tonight. Jesus, thank you. God has blessed us with the opportunity to come to his house of prayer yes. and to worship him in spirit and in truth. And I praise God because we have the liberty to go to the house of prayer Amen. and we don't have to hide, we don't have to lie, we don't have to go behind anyone's back to worship the Lord. Thank we you, Lord. can do it openly, freely, on a street corner, Hallelujah. at a park, thank or you. in the house of prayer. And we can do it with all our heart and with all our mind, and we can give our body to him and say, Father, take control. When we come to the house of prayer, we dance, we sing, Amen. we rejoice, Amen. we receive his word, and we also praise him in our offering. So we ask if you would like to give a donation to the house of God, that the kingdom may grow with your donations. We thank you so much, and I know the Lord will bless you in a mighty way. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. Father God, we come before you this evening, praising and glorifying your name. Thank you, Jesus. We raise this offering up to you, and we ask you to receive it. Father, we give what we don't have, but we give it anyway. Receive our offering with our love. Bless it, Father, and use it, Lord, to grow your kingdom.